You know, we were trying to do too much and do it and serve too many people that we weren't specific enough. Mm. And we taught it. I mean, that's, you know, something we're always teaching niche down, niche down, niche down, but we weren't necessarily doing it ourselves. We thought we had, but you know, I, I went through a, you were actually at a, a training event mm-hmm. and that's when it happened. It was yeah. like, you came to me and said, we got to do something. <laughs> yep. And, mm-hmm. and since then I feel like everything has just exploded. Mm-hmm. You know, it, it, we're, we are maybe being a little bit, you know, we're, no, it's, it's, it's what we need to do. And yeah. it's, it's been a good thing. Dana, what holds us back from that? Because I'm putting my hand up right there as well. Like I teach it, I talk to clients about it all the time. And, you know, I'm clearer and clearer every month about who my niche is. And yet we still want to be everything for everyone, don't we, in a, in a way. What is it? That, what is it? Well, I always think of it because I feel like I'm a servant leader and I want to serve everybody. Um, And I think that's probably goes for you as well. You know, you want to serve and how do you, how do you say, well, I don't want to serve them. I don't want to serve them, but you do, you can serve everybody Mm -hmm. by niching down. You're not going to, you know, stop that from happening. Mm -hmm. You're just going to be clearer on your focus Mm -hmm. and you're going to get more of those people. The other people are going to come too. Yeah. But I think it's because we, we just have that servant mentality. Mm -hmm. One of the things that was helpful to me was hearing uh, just some questions that were put to me. You know, I described our niche and somebody said, well, could you you uh, divide that niche into three buckets or four, whatever fits? And then they said, now, which one of those uh, buckets do most of your clients come from? And which ones do you think that you are equipped to give the top level of service to? And, you know, they're not all the same. And so we were able to look at that and say, okay, well, we'll let go of that bucket. (laughs) But we're going to hang on to these other ones. (laughs) But gradually over time, as we asked probing questions like that, we were Mm. able to focus more and more and then Mm. realize that the clarity it gave us Mm. also reflected in more clear clarity in our marketing messaging Mm. and uh, people identifying with, oh yeah, that's who I need. Mm. That's such, that is so helpful. 